My name is Helmut Augustin, my laboratory at the German Cancer Research Center in Heidelberg and at Heidelberg University studies the biology of blood vessels. We investigate towards this end how the cells of the vessel wall interact and communicate with cells of the microenvironment. In our publication, Parasite Express Type 2 receptor controls angiogenesis and vessel maturation. We show that a functional Type 2 receptor expressed by parasites on the vessel wall directly impacts parasite function and thereby plays an important role during tumor progression. This sounds very complicated, but I will try to explain this in simple public terms. Blood vessels are a transport system that supplies all cells of the body with oxygen and nutrients and removes waste products from the tissue at the same time, which makes them indispensable for life. The circulation of our over 5 liters of blood is powered by the body's hardest working organ, the heart. All blood vessels and small capillaries of one person combined have a total length of over 100,000 kilometers and could therefore circle our globe more than twice. If you imagine a blood vessel as a kind of tube, the inner layer of cells called endothelium keeps the blood cells inside the lumen and prevents clots from forming. On the outer side, endothelial cells of our smallest blood vessels, the capillaries, are supported by tiny muscle-like cells, so-called parasites, that stabilize the vessel wall. The formation of new blood vessels from existing ones, known as angiogenesis, depends on a sequential process that involves both endothelial cells and parasites. One signaling pathway controlling the association and interaction of blood vessel cells is the angiopoietin tie signaling. Here, we have identified the receptor molecule tie 2 on the surface of parasites that was previously thought to be exclusively on endothelial cells. We have studied the role of the surface receptor on parasites during healthy development, like it occurs during the growth of blood vessels in the eye and during the formation and growth of tumors. Cancer cells have an enormous need for oxygen and nutrients. Therefore, growing tumors rely on the recruitment of blood vessels and would not be able to exceed a size of 1 to 2 mm in diameter corresponding to the dimensions of a grain of sand without sufficient blood supply. Apart from that, blood vessels play an important role in the transport of chemotherapeutic agents given to patients to combat cancer. Therefore, an extensive knowledge of the blood vasculature of cancer lesions is indispensable for the development of further advanced therapeutic options to save patients' lives. Interestingly, tumors with parasites that do not have tattoo receptor grew much faster and displayed significantly more blood vessels. We have thereby established that HER2 and parasites act as a kind of break for vessel growth and thus for cancer as well, which was a very exciting finding for us. This new mechanism of vessel stabilization by parasite HER2 substantially adds to our current knowledge and the development of new treatment strategies. You want to know more about our work? Please take a look at our recent publication in Nature Communications in which the findings about TIE2 and parasite is spelled out in much detail.